There aren't many bigger games in English football than this one. Certainly two highly successful clubs with passionate sets of supporters. All the live action coming up from the Emirates as Arsenal take on Chelsea. Well, no doubt about it, gunning for victory. The home side tonight, we're in North London, the home of Arsenal. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And options in the centre. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, Trent about it. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Marvellous defending. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Well, they're going to play with two wingers in this 4-3-3 formation. So they need to switch the ball quickly and get crosses into the box. But they also need to get at least two midfield players making runs into the penalty area. That's a must. And support available. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Playing it short, a fine block. He's keen on cutting in. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Well, it's always a delight to watch Bukayo Saka in action. We have that privilege today. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out the situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Who can he pick out? Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Just couldn't get it through. And snuffed out the danger immediately. James. Trevor Shalaba. Mikhailo Mudri. Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Pulls it back. Oh, that's it's there for him. Oh, chance missed. Nil nil it remains. Well, chances don't come much better than that. What a miss that is. Well, he can't believe his side haven't taken the lead there. That was a big chance. Thomas Partey. Rice. Getting in there to intercept. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all. challenge we're using the space really well but now can they push on the delivery he succeeds in clearing it Connor Gallagher Really. 
Well, that one has promise. Possession lost by Arsenal. A chance to whip it in. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. from Arsenal to win it back Arsenal pushing forward with options available opportunity it is Conor Gallagher Palmer with it Fancy footwork. And a good take under duress there. Arsenal doing well to regain possession. Rice. Out of play and an Arsenal throw in forthcoming. take the lead short corner favorite and crossed in there oh great header smart stop though the last week's build-up play has been excellent just look at those stats but their finishing just hasn't matched their approach play they oh wait a moment Stuart look at what's happening and really going for power but the opportunity's been squandered but I'm not sure going for power was the right option I think that should have been placed into the corner One minute added on at the end. And there we have it. The first half action is over here at the Emirates. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Well, it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. So back underway with an intriguing second half in prospect. Coming up for Chelsea, can they make good use of it? Delivering it, real need to get rid of it. Tommy Yasu. The fans want to see a shot. Excellent block by Thiago Silva. Crossard. Cleared away over the byline and a corner kick to come. the delivery oh a really good header but the goalkeeper there's a cover up another corner kick conceded let's see what they do this time and 
taken short. Delivering it into the box. Well, body in the way. Can they keep it out? Mudrik. Successfully cut out. Declan Rice. It's with Erdogan. Excellent block by Thiago Silva. Given away by Chelsea. Need to get tighter. Preferring to go infield. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Rice. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Could be dangerous. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. One terrific save after another. Committed challenge. Made it a bit too easy for his opponent. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Might take the lead. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Nothing comes of it. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Substitution time it is here. human barrier Caicedo it needs an accurate cross James well, they know they need to stop him threat but fizzled out now we're inside the final 15 minutes and support available Goes a plan in the end, unable to get himself back on side here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Seeded by the Gunners. Who can he pick out? Well, Arsenal have to get the ball forward quickly now. The crowd are demanding just that little bit more effort. What a finish we've got on our hands here. Progress made by Chelsea and at this late and what a chance to end the stalemate well what an opportunity to probably win the game Derek that's a big miss time for a change then
Martin Erdogan. Making progress. Gabriel Jesus! My goodness, that save. Holy stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. So a personnel change then. Short corner routine. Really good build up, but no end product. Now, oh, can they hit them on the counter? Need to get back quickly here. Real chance. And a goal! At this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? William Saliba. Partey. It's with Gabriel. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, breezing past him. Martinelli. It's got to be! Oh, magnificent from the keeper! Fantastic stop! A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. How can he take them on and beat them? A fine reading of the situation. Gabriel Jesus. Well, with the support of these fans, Arsenal are throwing everything at this now. What a finish we're going to get to this game. Time and the scoreline against Arsenal. But still they're in this. And the keeper more than equal to it. Corner kick, and who knows, this might represent the last chance to grab an equaliser. <laughs> Playing it in. And that is that. The referee brings this match to an end and Chelsea get the three points. What did you make of their performance as a whole? Well, outplayed, outpassed and at times overrun. But they rode their luck and scored when it mattered. It's a great result for them. Well, you know, when our colleagues in the newspapers come out with their grades for this match, he's going to get very high marks. Well, if anyone deserved to be the match winner, it was him. He played really well today and what a big goal that was.